Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be working with this beautiful curly wig from Eunice Hair. This is a 13x4 lace frontal jerry curly wig with the kinky edges. It's not like your normal silky edges. These are meant to be like fluffy, kinky, like natural looking. So, um, well this wig is 24 inches to start out with, but I am going to cut it later on. To start out with, I'm just kind of like playing with the edges because I personally don't really know how to do edges on a wig. So I'm just kind of like playing around with them, trying to see what shape would look good. This is the shape that I came up with. And I decided that I wanted them to stay looking just like fluffy and effortless. Like that look like you don't really put much effort into your edges. They just lay that way. So I was going in with some hairspray just to kind of get them to stick. I am going to fix them later on. But for now, I just wanted to just kind of map them out before I get to styling the hair. I am going to be cutting this wig, making it look super natural. So you will see that once I'm done with the edges, I believe. So I decided to cut this wig because I just like the short natural look when it comes to curly wigs and I just knew that this texture would be perfect to get the look that I was going for. I was going for the, like I said, natural, super natural looking curly wig like it could be my own hair. I just thought it would fit really well with these edges so I was right. You guys will see it in the end. It turned out beautiful. Even though my edges could use a little work but... It turned out beautiful in the end, so I'm just going to be snipping off a lot of the length, um, a good amount. You're going to see right now, I'm snipping it off, and I'm going to go in and kind of like layer, but not layer, just like give it some dimension so that it looks, what's the word? Natural. Um, I love doing this with curly wigs. I just think it makes them look so pretty, and I really think that whenever I do my wigs like this, they just fit me so well like they just look so good on me so I'm going in and doing that and then after I'm done cutting it I'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys what I'm gonna do later I'm just gonna go through with my water bottle and wet it I did not use foam in this wig I didn't feel like the curls needed foam so I tried to use foam at first and I was like nah I'm just gonna wet it and then use my denim brush to define the curls and then I let it air dry just a little bit and then I went in with my diffuser just kind of speed up the process and then once I got done diffusing it took my hands shook it up got it real big and pretty and that's the finished look it's gonna look so beautiful once I'm done you guys will see you will see you will see just trust the process but let me just say this wig was so 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 soft and so nice like I love the Jerry curl curl pattern like it's just so pretty to me like makes me wish my natural hair was this curl pattern like I love it so much it's so pretty especially when you, when you wet it and use a denim brush to really define it so so pretty this hair was super soft I wouldn't expect anything less from Eunice they always have good hair every time I try them but yes I did bleach the knots in this week let me tell you guys I bleached the heck out of these knots I bleached them so much that I over bleached them like you can't tell but if you get up close to these knots they are platinum blonde and that new bleach powder well, I've been using this bleach powder for a couple months now but the bleach powder that I use that stuff literally literally it bleaches hair like it gets it platinum blonde like no toner nothing needed I'm gonna show y'all my updated bleaching routine very very soon I just gotta find the time for it I just don't be having time lately but I'm gonna show y'all but anyways yeah just cutting the wig getting the layers the hair was nice super soft super silky loved it I did not glue this wig down it came in an elastic band so I just turned it into a glueless wig it's not technically a glueless wig but you know I just can't do glue anymore I just can't so that's all I did but all in all the hair was nice Eunice amazing company I'm gonna have their website link below and the direct link to this wig down below for you guys as well 
if you want to check them out i do recommend them i do recommend this wig this wig was just beautiful i love this wig like if i didn't over bleach it and like the hair wasn't like falling out i would definitely keep wearing it but i love this wig so yeah everything like my below for you guys if you're not subscribed please hit the subscribe button it would mean so much to me give this video a thumbs up if you liked it if you like how the curls turn out in the end give this video a thumbs up i am out of breath i don't know if y'all can tell i'm out of breath so i'm gonna go i'm gonna let you guys go ahead and finish watching the video and i hope you guys enjoy it and i hope you love the final look and i hope you think it turned out as pretty as i think it turned out thank you guys so much for watching and i will talk to you next time bye guys